Hello from the studios at Pascual Bravo University. Have you ever wondered if there would ever be a day where individuals would be able to move objects by using only their thoughts? Gone are the days when telekinesis was just part of a science fiction project. A few groundbreaking researchers from Minnesota College of Science and Engineering have evidently just changed this science fiction to reality. How? They were able to control a helicopter solely by using brain waves. But what is telekinesis? Telekinesis is nothing but the science that deals with controlling objects by our mind. And in this particular case, brain waves generated signals that were able to harness the control of the helicopter. The researchers used a remote controlled helicopter robot containing a camera on the front side and which had full ability to move in all directions. This helicopter robot was controlled by none other than a human brain. One of the lead researchers in the study indicated that for the first time, humans were able to control the flight of flying robots using just their thoughts, sensed by non-invasive brain waves. In order for this to work, the controller, the human, must imagine the robot moving, which triggers specific neurons in the brain's motor cortex that leads to electronic currents. Currents are detected by electrodes in an EEG cap, which then will send signals to the computer. Next, the computer will translate the signal pattern into a command to the robot via Wi-Fi. If the controller imagines raising up their right hand, the robot will move right. If the controller imagines raising up their left hand, the robot will move left. And if the controller imagines raising both hands, the robot will move up. The purpose of the project is to create computer brain interface technology geared to helping people with a disability or various neurodegenerative diseases to help them regain mobility, independence, and enhanced performance. This technology will allow them to help control wheelchairs, artificial limbs, or any other device. However, imagine being able to cook your dinner, play chess, change TV channels, or a million other things just by thinking about them. I am Gary Vernier, and this has been a Pascual Bravo English documentary. Until next time, good luck with English.